Hello YouTube. Hey, this is uh, Derek Jitter and I am making my first YouTube video. And what we're going to do tonight in my wonderful kitchen is we are going to make, that's right, we are going to make, I am actually going to make chocolate covered bacon. Yes, that's what I'm going to make tonight, chocolate covered bacon. More to come. Check it out. I'm going to be uh, making chocolate covered bacon from the awesome place, Benton's Smoky Mountain Bacon. Now, if you don't know about Benton's Smoky Mountain Bacon, let me show you what it looks like. That's in this packaging. This bacon is made in Tennessee. They actually smoke the bacon for three days after aging it for 30 days. It is the most delicious smoky bacon that you're going to get. And I'm going to make a whole pound of this and I am going to put some nice chocolate on top of it. So stay tuned guys. I'm going to show you how to make it. All right, folks. First thing, what we have to do is oven up to 350 degrees. So let me see if I know how to uh, use my oven, which I do not know how. But, uh, oh, wow, one button, 350. Look at that, 350, 350. I don't know if you guys can see that. But we're going to get this thing up to 350. And then once we get this oven up to uh, 350 degrees, we are going to lovely, lovely, lovely nice. All right. Okay, guys. Got the bacon all laid out. Got six uh, strips of bacon laid out there. That's about a little bit more than a little bit of half a, half a pound. Fortunately, you guys can't smell this delicious bacon. And uh, as soon as my oven, uh, which is uh, warming up right now, it is up to uh, 350. Ah, it is up to 350 right now. I will be putting this lovely bacon on into the oven right now. Ah, yes. At 350 degrees here. And uh, we'll be cooking this to a nice golden brown. There we go. Going into the oven there. All right, we're going to close that on up. And, uh, all right, folks, here's some of that delicious chocolate. Nice milk chocolate with a nice swirl in it that I'm going to be using uh, to drizzle on top of this lovely, lovely bacon. So um, stay tuned, guys. Um, more to come. All right, folks, let me give you a little update. We're about 10 minutes in cooking this bacon. Look at that bacon there. Listen to that sizzle. Look at that bacon just curling up like that. I may have to get something to flatten it out or flip them over, but it's going well, guys. Stay tuned. All right, folks. About to take these delicious strips of bacon out of here and uh, put them on the tin foil and drizzle of that delicious chocolate on it. Okay, guys. Time to take out this delicious. Uh, yeah. Pull this out right here. Yeah, you see that delicious bacon? Ooh. You guys should be able to smell this bacon. I'm gonna take this bacon out. I'm gonna put it on this tin foil right here. Get this and get this uh, chocolate that's melting right now. Should be done melting right now. Look at this delicious slice of bacon. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that bacon. We are, yes we are. So get this bacon up on here, this uh, chocolate out of here, and we'll start drizzling it on this bacon, and uh, we'll go from there, guys. So let's see, I'm going to try to keep this video continuously running, keep it continuously running right now. Alright, let me grab this chocolate, and drizzle this on here. ready to go. Yes. And we're going to drizzle the chocolate on the bacon. That might be a little bit too much right there. And that may be a little bit too much chocolate. I'll get that off a little bit later. Gonna have to dab it, dab it, dab it. Then after we get this 
chocolate ones here. You're going to. We are going to. We are going to put it in the refrigerator to get it nice and cold. And then we're going to do this taste test. Get this. Get this one here. This piece right here. A little more difficult. We got this. This one right here. Ah, got it off of there. So scoop it right back on this one right over here, guys. Got this bacon. Yes, we are going to get this on and popping. Chocolate covered bacon. Next, the next scene will be it all wet. Oh, look at that! Drizzle it on there. Yes, just throw it on there. Just throw it on there. It don't matter. It don't matter. It's gonna be delicious. Next scene I'm gonna have coming out of the refrigerator and uh, going from there. Thank you guys for tuning in. See you in a couple minutes. Here's the final project. Right here, guys. I got three pieces in this little tin right here. Now, some of you guys that eat a lot of fast food may may uh, know these tins. These tins right here, these little plastic trays right here, get them from little fine Chinese restaurants or little Korean restaurants or little Thai food restaurants. And uh, they, they, they give them to you as little takeout trays. But... Uh, me, I keep these little takeout trays. They wash out very good, and they come in handy just as some things like this. Now, I'm going to take a piece of this bacon, and uh, I'm going to be biased, obviously, but uh, you guys don't have to be biased. Well, some of you guys tomorrow will get some of this delicious bacon if you guys know me. Some of you guys will get some of this delicious chocolate butter bacon. Put it in the refrigerator for about 20 minutes. Mm. Got about 20 minutes of it in in my refrigerator. This is so delicious. I'm gonna take a little bite of it. Hopefully tomorrow. Mmm. That smoky flavor. Along with that chocolate mixing in. It tastes so delicious. So that's how you make chocolate covered bacon, guys. That bacon in the oven. So that grease don't fly all over your kitchen. Kitchen be nice and clean. Nice and flat. You get to drizzle that chocolate right on top of it. Some of you guys tomorrow will um, get to taste some of this uh, delicious bacon. Some of you guys will not. That's my time for the day. My first YouTube video. Billy Bay Strumming Comedian. I'm out.